This is the Turnigy XP D2836 8 turn 1100 kV motor. This is my motor of choice for mid sized planes from about 700 to 1200 grams all up weight. It's a good balance of uh, medium kV, good for efficiency, but yet decent power as well. If I could only have one motor for my scratch built foam board airplanes, this would probably be it. This is the motor I used for the J Scott sent to flight test. It also served me very well on the earlier versions of the Ansley Peace Drone. In a twin configuration, I used this motor on my short Skyvan cargo dropper, which carried over 1,200 grams of cargo. This motor comes with the 3.5 millimeter bullet connectors already attached, which is very nice. The overall length of the motor proper is just under 36 millimeters, which goes along with the nomenclature of 36, and is right about 28 millimeters in diameter. Therefore, the 28 millimeter diameter, 36 millimeter length, and eight turns on the uh, stator coils. The overall length, including the installed shaft, is 48 millimeters, and the length of the actual rotor is just over 30 millimeters. It comes with a four millimeter shaft protruding through the rotor side and which somewhat simplifies the installation in most applications, wherein the motor mount is at the rear and the shaft is at the opposite end. It does come with a prop adapter and screws. This motor weighs 73 grams, or 2.5 ounces. This medium-sized motor is rated for 336 watts at 18 amps maximum. However, I can tell you I've pushed that well into the 20s. It can operate with a 3 or 4 cell LiPo. I prefer to use a 3 cell and it gets plenty of thrust over a kilogram as you'll see in the test. Here is the Turnigy Plush 40 amp speed controller from Hobby King. The Plush series is renowned for reliability and for good functioning and it is programmable as well. It does not come with any bullet connectors attached nor a battery connector attached. It has a 3 amp switching BEC. 3 amps is generous enough for 5 or 6 average sized servos. I will admit that a 40 amp ESC is not really necessary for this motor, but it is nice to have the extra upgrade in the BEC as well as the margin of safety for the amp draw. Otherwise, an ESC such as the Turnigy Plush 30 amp or the Turnigy HexFET 25 amp would do just fine with this motor. For this round of testing, I'll use three 2200 milliamp hour 3 cell nanotech battery packs connected in parallel for a nominal voltage of 12.4 volts. Here we'll be testing the Turnigy D2836 8 turn 1100 kV motor with a variety of propellers using the uh, Turnigy Plush 40 amp speed controller. This is a very capable speed controller and we'll be using it for all the tests. Uh, won't be any torture test for this round, but we'll mostly focus on the propeller choices for this motor. To follow our screenshots of each of the individual results, however, you may wish to skip right to the spreadsheet on my shared Google Drive by clicking the link in the description. 